You can ask me anything. So we're here in the club level at Davis Wade Stadium and it's ladies clinic day for the football team or the football coaching staff and there's over a hundred women here dressed in their maroon and white who are ready to hear a little bit about Mississippi State and learn a little bit about football and have a good time in the process. We're going to talk to a few of them, so come along. And they're lined up. It like goes all the way down the goal line. They're like that, like 50 yards of ladies getting football player autographs here. I'm telling you, they would not show up at 8 o'clock on a Saturday morning and sign autographs for a bunch of little boys. It's only for pretty ladies that they're going to get here. Look at Bob. He's so happy. Thanks, How are you? <laughs> What's it say on the back? To be a Bulldog is great. I like that. Great, adjective, Gator Bowl and Egg Bowl champions, an extraordinary football team and coaching staff. No elephants, no tigers, no bears. We're just better than they are. That's gonna be a bestseller. We have Dan's Divas. Y'all, everybody kind of kind of fill in here around. We get, this is Dan's Divas. How many Dan's Divas are there? There's 13 of us at there, present at this time. That's an unlucky number. I know, but it's okay. We're Bulldogs, so it's all right. Okay, okay. As long as you're a diva and a bulldog, it's okay. Now they got they have a sign. I saw one sign, sign. that said This one says this is our our state. This is our state. Here's the other one. It says this is our clinic. No men and, and they let me slip in. Despite appearances to the contrary, no men. I mean, we've got AD allowed. Yeah. My question for the AD, we're looking out across the stadium. And right. You see the, the new red over there. Is that where the banners are going to be? And explain to us what the banners are. The, the, uh, you're talking about the, the names of the, yes. of the four grades? They're we, actually. We see this down here going in. We right. We want to know what it is. We're, they're actually going to be on that the second fascia there, the smaller one, the, the one down low. Um, and it's going to be white lettering that has those men's names, yeah. the four men's name, Johnny Cooks, Jack Crystal, Dee Dee Lewis, Lewis, and Jackie Parker. Those are obviously four great Bulldogs, and we're going to honor them, and then we're going to have leave room to come back and add others through the years. And then above that, the face above that there is where the new ribbon boards are going to be put in here in a week or so. They're already starting on the east side, and uh, that's going to add, that's going to take the energy of the, ribbon, of the video board all the way around the stadium. Good job. Can you tell me where the Divas banner is? The Diva banner. <laughs> we, might, we might have to paint that at midfield. Yeah. Okay, that'll work. That'll work. That'll work. All right, ask your question. You can ask me anything. I want to hear it. And I'm not going to, I don't have anywhere to run. I can't, I can't like, you know, tell you I have, a, I have another call to take or something. If we win against LSU on Thursday, we're going to get out on Friday. Are they going to have class on Friday? <laughs> well... We may shut down the athletic department on Friday after we went on Thursday. I don't control the class schedule. We, Dr. Keenum did go, shut it down for Thursday, which is, which is a good start. I'll have to go talk to him. Absolutely. We'll, we'll have to get asked ask the president. Hey, I'll we'll get asked the president. Uh, well, there, there, right there you go. I can't trump that. Heads up, Dr. Keenum. <laughs> no, my question is... Um, are we going to have a whiteout game this year? Are we going to? That's a good question. Are we going to have a whiteout because game? Because I usually would tweet you that question. We we are, and it's actually going to be the LSU game on Thursday I'll be night. Here. I'm taking off that Friday. Are you really? Yeah, ladies need to shop. We Absolutely. Need to know. We well, need we're, to get we're white no class on Thursday, and you're not going to have work on Friday. What? Awesome. That's going to be Ring nice. Ring bell because so, that's exciting. That's right. So we're going to start the new football complex. I hope we'll start it this fall. Because we've got, we've uh, we've raised a good bit of money for it, and Dan says we need it, so we're going to do it. And we're keeping the cowbells. And we're keeping the cowbells. This is a tacky question. You're not going to want to use it. What are you going to do about the ticket scalpers? The ticket scalpers. You know, we yeah. we tell people there's really there's a law against it. Number one, so you can't. Yes. But we do encourage people that be careful who you're buying from. Know the person, because I tell you the biggest issue with the scalp is not necessarily the scalping as much as it is people buying counterfeit tickets. And they well, paid, they, they, they show up at the gate with a, they, they were sold a ticket from somebody they didn't know and it was a fake. And they show up at the gate and they can't get in because we, we scan the tickets and it's not in the computer. Know who you're buying a ticket from. That's the most important thing. Make sure it's someone you can trust. Yeah. Or if you're buying it from somebody out there, walk them to the gate, make sure and get scammed before you hand them the money. Oh, no.
All right, that's our first installment of Ask the AD and had a lot of good questions. Appreciate everybody here at the Ladies Clinic who uh, I put them on the spot so they could put me on the spot. We had a lot of fun. Uh, but look out, we're going to be moving around at ball games this season and giving other people opportunities to do the same thing and ask the questions. Uh, so I'm going to sneak in here if they'll let me and check out uh, what goes on at Ladies Clinic. And uh, they may not let me, but if I find out any information, I'll let you know. Uh, get rested up, get ready for a great season, and go dogs.